Why, hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 1. Oh, yeah. Where we left off, well, let me be honest with y'all. We got a lot of missions to do. Oh, yeah. So let's get straight into it. As always, ladies and gentlemen, I do hope y'all enjoy. Sit back and relax, and let me and Mr. Jack do the rest. Actually, what is close to us that we could go to right now? Bonnie. It looks like we're going to be doing some quests for Bonnie today. As always, ladies and gentlemen, I do hope you all enjoy. Sit back and relax and let me, Mr. Jack, do the rest. And if you like what you see, make sure you hit that subscribe button so you can always be notified um, when I upload something else. It definitely helps a lot. And I do appreciate it quite a lot. But enough of that. Let's go. Let's go check with her up. what's up with Bonnie. Oh, Bonnie! My God, what's going on? You can now help the ranch hands patrol... The farm. Can I? Hello. Search the. I mean, search the area for the dog for any disturbance. I doggo. Lasso and hogtie enemies or stop them by any means before morning. Extra crash is rewarded for keep them in your life. Extra cash on my lord, man. Do I really have to be that serious? Do I really have to? It's extra cash, though. So do we really want to do that? Yes, we do. Because it's extra cash. All right. Fine. Fine. I'll try. Uh, what's wrong, boy? You smell trouble? You smell evil? Boy, what's wrong? Tell me. Tell me the path. Tell me the path. Do you smell evil, boy? Do you smell the evil that comes forth in this place? Can you go a little bit quicker? I'm not gonna lie, your dog. Come on now. Run. Run, doggo. Doggo, run. Come on, run. Yeah, come on. Do you sense danger? Is it in here? No? Is there any danger? <clears throat> I don't think there's any danger because it's so quiet. I don't see or anything. Oh shit. Hello. Oh shit, wait, wait for me, wait for me. Stop the break in. Get away from that window. How you doing back there? You want me to kill you? Get this hip off of me. It's making me nervous. Go to the foreman office to collect your reward. You can leave him here. The local law officers will get this guy. Oh, shit. All right. Good job, doggo. You did very good. And now we get some money to imagine. I like to have my horse with me just in case. Because, you know, Bonnie Quest is going to be next. Hello. I did what you needed. Thanks. All right, now Bonnie Quest is here. Okay, let's see what's up with Connie. Connie, oh my God, I meant Bonnie, not Connie. Come on, come on, let's go. Hey, Get him in there. Come on, come on. Hey, miss. Hey, miss. I got most of the horses secure and the chicken. Well, thank you, Amos, but it's the herd I'm worried about. I know. They're scattered all over the valley and beyond. The weather is coming in real fast. So what do you suggest, Amos? We leave the herd out there to be scattered by the storm and ourselves left here to die without a livelihood? Can I help? No, miss. If the men get caught out in that storm, they're gonna die. And if we lose our herd, we'll all die, you stupid man. Doesn't sound like we're left with much of a choice then. Come on, Amos. Round up your men. Let's get the herd. Dang. Oh. 
I am so sorry for that. There was a knock in my door. I need to check what it was. It was just a mail. I am so sorry for that. I do apologize. Alright, let's go. I do apologize for that. There was a knocking at the door. Bad timing. somewhere some in big old books others in big old bottles of whiskey believing in some kind of divine purpose ain't gonna get me my wife and kid back pastors who we are miss McFarland and there ain't no change in that faith is a luxury I can't afford drive them over to the pasture by the old oak tree we'll merge them with the other herd there okay I could do that 11 of 11 okay so we gotta make sure we don't leave any of the cows. Can you like go on the left side and then... I could see them, trust me. Hey! Where the fuck you going? You saw that when he was thinking that he was fucking free spirit. Put your ass over there. You better get your ass over there, you little fucking cow. Okay, we got 11 out of 11. Come on, come on, let's go, let's go. The other cow return, I appreciate that. Can you um, go a little bit to the right? A little bit to the right. A little bit to the right, come on. There we go. A little bit to the right. Okay, that's 11 out of What the freak? Hey! Get over there! There we go. Move in front of the herd to slow them down. Oh my god, don't. Don't go off the cliff. We we can't have that. We can't have that, for real. Did I got him? Is everyone calm? Oh my god, that one's gonna jump! Go back, motherfucker! Go! Go! Oh my god, I got the fucking sassy cow. Return to Bonnie. All right, well, you could stay there, you fucking gal, because clearly you'd want to stay. Bonnie, what's up? Ah, right. oh, Bonnie, I had a sassy cow on the right side, and it wasn't fun. 
Yes, I'm gonna help you. What the hell you think I'm doing? Dancing? Yeah. You better get your ass back. Hey. Go now. Move the herd back to the ranch. Listen, lady, this isn't my job. I already pay her back more than enough. I fucking hate herding cows. Because they don't listen. Are, are you seriously? You saw that, right? She got salty that I told her to wait. She was going to push me. Probably if I move back a lot, they'll run a little bit quicker. I don't know. I'm testing theories out. Go. This one is a sassy one. I know it is. Oh, fuck you. Go to the other place over here, man. How far is your ranch? If a train comes, you're going to become ground beef. I'm telling you right now. We have so many cows. Why is it only us two? This takes more than two people. Go in there. Go in there. Are you serious? Are you serious? Go in there. Are you serious with me? Okay, that's all 21. You're welcome. You saved the herd back there. You might make a decent rancher one day. Thank you, Miss McFarland. We finally did it all. Huzzah. We finally did it. Huzzah. We have finally done it. We became one with the ranch. It looks like the next quest we have is for the policeman. Let's see what's up with him. Oh man, honestly. Oh, that was difficult, honest. And I got disturbed right in the bad time for that too, honestly. I really did. I got really disturbed in the bad time for that. I wasn't trying to be rude, but Jesus Christ, it was bad timing. Wait. Oh shit. It's down beneath. Oh shit. Wait a minute. American Appetite again? What the hell is going on with this quest? I keep getting this quest nonstop. In case y'all don't remember, I forgot everything about this game. I did play it back in the day. But I got this game back in the day when it first came out. So I forgot absolutely everything. Um. So I have no idea what the hell is wrong with this quest. I keep getting it non-stop. Ow! At least you don't fall. You're not as idiotic like the other one. Uh, hello. And who are you? Hello. Talk to the man. Well, howdy. Excuse me, friend. Mind if I rest up at your camp spell? Well, that'd be my pleasure. Man needs a break from this desiccated land. Thank you, mister. Say, what's that stick you got there? Oh, y'all ain't never seen a dowsing rod before, mister? Never seen a man summon the water up from the bare earth, uh, mister, uh... Marston. Ah. No, can't say I have. Hmm. It's water you're looking for. What's wrong with that lake over there? Oh, there ain't nothing wrong with Lake Don Julio. Nothing wrong with it, but 
we lack the fancy irrigation equipment you folks have back east, so. Man needs a wellspring on his proper tie to ranch here. Makes sense. Yeah. Why, you know, just last week, I was over at Old Pleasant's house. Now, I think I may have found something, but... Old Coot that owns the place threatened to call the law down on me, so... People act funny around strange men with sticks. They sure do. Damn fools. Bet you he don't even know how much water's running underneath his proper tie. You want me to tell him? <laughs> you know what? You ain't that stupid, mister. And I can tell. I'll tell you what. Why don't you go get the old man to sell us his proper top for a small pittance? Then I can find the source of the water, build us a proper wellspring. Maybe I will. Well, all right then. <laughs> I visit the house northwest of Armadillo. Uh, do we have that quest active at the moment, though? That's the real question. Do we have it active at the moment? It seems so. Let's go do this quest. Wait, maybe. I'm not sure, actually. I think it's this one over here that the quest is activated. Water and honesty. This one right here is just another stranger. I guess we could pluck it as well to see what they want. About time we get some side missions, to be honest with you. We've been doing massive amount of main quests. Oh, be the game by the time it's done already. Where was this person at? Ah, uh, hello? Ma'am? What are you doing? Are you okay? Everything alright, ma'am? It's Miss. Oh. Oh, let me look at you. My gentleman caller. You remind me of my Peter. Have you seen him? I don't think so. Where is that man? We'll be late for the ceremony. He must still be at the saloon in Armadillo, talking to the musicians. He's such a fine man. Must be making things right for me, as usual. Well, I gotta get going, ma'am. I'm sure your Peter will be just fine. Wait, I beg you. Would you possibly go fetch him for me? This was meant to be my perfect day. Please, sir. Something must have happened. I can't bear it. So you want me to go find your Peter so you can have a perfect day? Yes, please, sir. I'll see what I can do. Oh. Um, we are gonna help Grandmama. Are you kidding me? Talk to the musician in Armadillo to see what people is. I'll I'll find him. No worries, young lady. No worries. Hang on. Let me see what's going on here. Let no man put asunder. Is that it? Doctor's office. Motion. Uh. Let me see here. I'm gonna help grandma, are you kidding me? I'm gonna help grandma, I'm not gonna leave her hanging. I don't like that. I think it's this one, let no man of Sunder put on Sunder. Let's see, Jenner. Mm. Let no man of ask you to look for her. Soon to be, pe oh, okay, yeah, yeah, I live with that one, water and honesty. Okay, let's go help grandma out, because I'm not going to leave her over here. I feel bad if I fuck, hell no, man. Grandma, my, hang on, I'm going to go get you some cock. Not, not like that, I am talking about the rooster, you know, cock -a -doo -doo. come on now, have some decency. Grandma, my, clearly wanted the rooster that... Is her soon-to-be husband? Thank you. 
Uh, let's go and talk to this guy first before we go and pluck the other quests. I don't want to touch that X mark. Where is... Is it in deal? Am I going to touch the quest? Please don't touch the... God's sakes! Not particularly. Listen, son, I know you got a mission. Right now, I need another gun. Why? What's happening? I've had this problem for months with this group of bandits getting drunk and murdering settlers. Last night, they went to a big place up near Ridgewood. They burnt the place down, killed the men, burning most of them alive, and raped the women. The women whole thing got their throats slit. One of them survived and walked in here this morning. Anyway, we got a posse gathering up near Ridgewood. Will you ride with us? All right. Thank you, John Marston. It's gonna be a bloody job. Huh. I don't think I know any other kind, sir. I'm gonna have to agree with him. Do we really know any? Damn, boy, you look like a freaking... Hey! Oh, shit. He looks like Humpty Dumpty sat on the wall, and he legit took a great, great fall. <laughs> Damn. I. I hear you caught up with Mr. West and Chicken. I did. For a man who claims to have found a remedy to all ailments, he was in pretty bad shape. His tonic has helped a great many people. It's a medical breakthrough from the East, the result of years of research. If only it could cure him of his diarrhea of the mouth. I wouldn't be so dismissive of science if I was you. I mean, maybe I could drink some coffee right, right now. He's no more a scientist than I am a priest. All right. There's a campfire here. It looks like a whole bunch of corpses and one bird. You have acquired a new weapon in the same category as one you already own. Check the weapon. Okay. Return to Marsha. Alright. I didn't want to do this quest now. I hope you know. I was trying to look for a woman cook. But I have no choice but to do it now because it's here. And it looks like the other one, the appetite one, is in the way. That's a fair way to see Sunday, actually. Agreeing. Oh my god, they killed some some type of people here. Oh my god, wait. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. God, there's no loot. Okay. I abandoned him. Me? I was looking for the sweet loot. Oh, this motherfucker. I abandoned him. Me. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, me, Jackie boy here, abandoned the fucking mousher. Listen, you asshole. You did not just restart me. Don't do it, Jack. Don't do it. Don't do it. It's not worth it. Fuck you. Opportunity. 
apparently. Try telling that to a farmer with no head for business. Or a blacksmith whose customers can buy tools for half the price out of a Spalding's catalog. Giving a man too many options will make him unhappy. Taking too many away will force him to do things he shouldn't. It's wrong to assume change is always good. Hey, Marshal, see those vultures? I see them. Marston, you and Eli go check it out. Hi. Uh, I'm gonna go check it out <sighs> again. Oh God, another bird! God sakes! Man, this don't look too good. Somebody was so busy killing people, they went and dropped their gun. Oh shit! Let's go. Let's go. Can I just take this really quick? Come on. I'm on my way. Uh, maybe I shouldn't do that because they're going to get away from me again. My bad. My bad. I was just looking for the, the pigeon because I'm a collector of some sorts. Okay, stay here. Allow me. How about in the party party? Are they in the party party? Let me get my knife out. You never know when you're going to need a knife. No one here. Nobody's taking a shit. The bomb, probably the bomb. They're probably in the bomb, that's for sure. There's no good reason for that to be boarded up. Break that door down. Rest you. Get your guns ready. They kill the cows. Oh my god. Holy shit. Let's go. You motherfuckers. Yeah, keep coming out. Come on. Y'all fucking attack defensive people. I'll become the true fucking bandit. I need to reload my gun. Whoops. Let me go in. Big boy, let me go. <laughs> God dang. 
Big boy, let me go in. I'm gonna go upstairs. You and me gonna have ourselves fun. I need to be careful with the lady, that's why I took the bullets. Oh, look what I found! Look what I found! I didn't even knew he had that, and I accidentally... I'm sorry. <laughs> oh my god, I found the, the dead eye. They are safe. I, I made sure of that. They are safe. I made sure of that one legit. They are safe. I didn't shot no one, none of them. They all save. But then some robbers started chasing him down like wild dogs. I thought you were supposed to protect us, Marshal. You fooky men. You ain't nothing. You're just a man on a government payroll taking money that the rest of us have to pay for with our lives. Yeah. What is wrong with this country? Hold up, men. The man that kills the boss of that bunch gets $50. It ain't about the money, Marshal. These are people's lives. People's homes! <laughs> up, boy. We gotta get after those bandits. To be fair, we did what we could. But I, I could see why she's upset at the same time. It's not like I'm purposely doing that. I killed him and I found my dead eye in the process. Hey horsey, you wanna come before the guy leaves me? I need to talk. They needed to hear it because there was right there. I do feel bad for them though. I could just imagine how many times people come to these people for help and they're not even there. To be honest. What? Do not tell me they were more hostages. I didn't kill you before, but I sure as shit will now. Get yourself down here, Bill. You know you ain't man enough to stop me. You know I don't want to kill you, but I will. You always did have a high opinion of yourself, John. <laughs> Dutch always said you were an arrogant son of a bitch. Fuck Dutch. Get him, boys. You really want to die? You really want to die? Everybody, take cover. In that shed. You really want to die? We don't have to do this. We roll together. Come on. Don't have to do this shit. Oh, will you look at that? Now that brings me memories, but how do we mark them though? Can we even mark them anymore? Doesn't seem so. Marsha, are you gonna um Have you know all to taught me everything, you fuckers? Oh, I thought he ran. Do, do you mind if I come out of this? Oh my god, really? I wanted to go take cover a little bit closer. There you go. You shouldn't have fought so hard. Hey, look what I got here. There's something that you're still breathing. Come here, boy. 
<laughs> Come on, Bessie, give! Oh. Norman Deke. <laughs> Fuck! Nice to see you again, buddy. Thanks for your help, John. Norman here is gonna help us get to Bill. Ain't you, Norman? Thank you, Mr. Dick. Mighty kind. Fuck you! Hog time. Let's get him to jail. There we go. Thank you. There we go. Now, um, if y'all don't mind, I have side missions to do that y'all kind of interfere. I was hoping that there's nothing in the um, police station because I still have the appetite one. No, it looks like there's nothing there. We're going to need to get this because that's right on the police station. And it looks like there's a lot of quests for that guy, you know, the, the sheriff. So it's better to get that quest out of the way. What the fuck? Okay. So it's better to get the quest out of the way and get that completed. I love this game though, honestly. It's become very good. Why the fuck are you in the way? Well, there's a train. We haven't seen the train in a minute. I'm really I'm glad that we found out how to activate the dead eye. But we can't mock them yet, it seems. I guess we just learned the dead eye out of nowhere because they haven't gave me the tutorial for that yet. Yeah, I had a habit from the previous one. That's why I did that. Don't touch the main quest. Don't touch the main quest. Okay, here we go. Hello? 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 Ma'am, what's going on? Talk to me. I know they're stupid. You okay, lady? won't do anything but he's a good man he don't drink nor lay with whores and he's been he's been missing for three days let me guess you went missing up in the hills how did you know mister just a guess if i find him i'll bring him back to you but people seem to go missing up there <laughs> oh my god if he's gone then what'll i do we ain't got much money and I'm with the family way again. As I said, I'll do what I can. <laughs> I have a bad feeling about this. I feel bad for her. But I have a bad feeling that... It's not gonna end well, honestly. I keep going to this quest non-stop over and over again and every single time I go there they kind of dead I, I don't know what else to say they really are kind of dead it's like what do y'all want me to do here like for real I feel bad for her because all these people are going missing up here something's going on in this place that I don't even know what the hell is going on. If I could, I prefer to eliminate whatever is there. That way I don't have to deal with it. Let me guess. Bones? There's somebody here! Please, help me. I've been oh, Mister, what the fuck? Mister, some city fella just attacked me and broke my leg. What? He broke my leg. Who the hell was he? Guy got kind of creepy on me. And then he got violent. When? Just now. Uh, he ran off that way. Can't have gone too far. If I find him, I'll bring him back this way. Thank you, mister. <laughs> Are you okay? You're all crazy! Hang... How talk the attacker and bring it to... 
Uh, hey, uh, I don't know. I don't know, to be honest with you. Is he actually the attacker or is it the other? Well, get over here. If you're the one who's been fucking killing these people, I'm going to knock you out. Uh, carrying. This is a nightmare. <laughs> Are you the one who's killing these people? I feel like it's the other way around, too. Like, honestly, I feel like it's the other guy that kills people. Well, if he tries any, then I'll kill him. I'll try not to kill him, but kill him nonetheless. Hold on, we're almost there. I want to know what the fuck is going on here. Please, I'll do anything. Hmm. Oh my good lord! Please get that man away from me. Uh, uh. Hey, fella. <laughs> You broke this poor fool's leg, mister. This maniac tried to eat me. <gasps> Cannibals in these here hills. Please help me. What? Please. Fella's got to eat now. Fella's got to eat. <laughs> Save me from this freak, please. Please. <laughs> Get your ass over here. Like I'm going to fucking let you eat him. I am so sorry. I'm so sorry. Come on. You motherfucker. Well, who am I to deny? I think he's only fail. Oh, he doesn't stop down like Alter does? Ah, shit. I guess a bullet in the head will be fine. Lord, I am so sorry, my dude. I did not know he was going to eat you. I let the other guy go. He should be fine now. Are you kidding me? Oh. You okay? Lloyd. Lloyd, we are all the time, unfortunately. So for now, we're going to have to end it here, unfortunately. I really do hope each and every one of you have a lovely night or day, depending on where you are. And as always, remember, I will truly see you all legit in the next one. Peace. I'm out of here.